Hey guys, it's Jess and we're doing a new kind of video. This is a plan as I go. This is the kit I'm using which is Scribble Prince Co Mystery Dropout. I made some date covers for it and the Simply Gilded Washi which I think you can still get on her store. So yeah, I thought this time I would try out, since I got the new um, Erin Conjurin, I really wanted to try out this extra plan as I go because um, it has to be uploaded at different times since I was planning this week as the days went by, I planned every day. Um, you'll see that I actually planned some days, a uh, little bits of days ahead and then went back and completed them and yeah, just sort of, it was really fun. Especially since my main plan with me is I never complete them when I film them and I end up filling them out during the week, so it's basically the same thing. <laughs> Um, but a new and different style, which I know is getting a lot more popular now, but I've been wanting to do it for ages since watching Mandy Dreams. And um, yeah, I'm just putting down some sort of setting up the week. So it's all ready to just plan through every day. Um, yeah, I like setting it up all first so I can have a watch look at it during the week. And yeah, so I apologize for this voiceover, it's a bit weird, but I'm not feeling very well today, but I wanted to get the voiceover done. So yeah, I'm just putting the date covers on, and these were inspired by the Caress Press Kit that used the same clip art as Scribble Prince Co, and I really wanted these date covers, so I made them myself, and I also have the clip art. Uh, you can just get it on Etsy. And yeah, now I'm going to put the bottom washi on, I think. But when I'm talking about stickers during the week, I will tell you about the ones where I bought the store that made them. Uh, but if they're from the kit or made them myself, I'll just say from the kit or by me. A lot of the stickers I make myself, you can easily find clip art on Etsy and make yourself as well. So it's not too hard to get. They're not, most of them aren't really original. <laughs> so I'm going to get the sidebar and this is the first time doing the sidebar in the new neutral planner so I was just trying to line it up. <laughs> it's a little tricky for the first go. But I think it worked out well. And then I decided to do sort of washi between each thing and hello there's Heidi my cat. <laughs> She decided to visit for a second. But yeah, so I thought, um, so yeah, I, you'll see me going back and forth. I, you know, completing some days, going back and marking things off, but that's because I filmed it every day of the week from the day, on the dates that you see. So yeah, that's why it's up a bit later. And um, I go back through things. <laughs> if you really like this style of planning, definitely check out Mandy Dreams and Ruby Trev as well. They both do this style um, all the time. So, <laughs> regularly, I guess you would say. Uh, sorry, I just can't think of anything right now. I thought I'd have to be talking way faster than I do right now, so. I'm just waiting for the weekly, the actually daily stickers go on. I actually found like it perfectly completed the sidebar with the daily habits, so that's pretty good. <laughs> Alright, now we'll get on to the days. I decided I wanted to put the today's stickers up the top just for cons some consistency and also because uh, the black things are a bit hard to cover. And I put down washi from the kit. And the coffee cup from the kit to start marking coffee that I love having every morning. <laughs> I have to excuse my handwriting, but meh, whatever. <laughs> handwriting is handwriting. So I had to do some big sections of rewriting every day. So I basically took full uh, boxes each day. And that is a sweet kawaii design laptop um but yeah so each day i'll have a full box basically marking out the writing that i had to do on uh, that morning to do 
get at least two hours of work blocked out. And sorry, this is out of focus, but it'll go back and focus in a second. This is a vent stick from the kit and my own doctor's stethoscope sticker, but I'll remove the sticker anyway because I changed my mind later. <laughs> and now I'm just going to go back and fill in the uh, sidebar as well as I can at the time. So yeah, I did a whole lot of pre-planning on the Sunday and then we start really getting into it. So now I'm going to take that sticker off and it's basically it really ripped up the page so yeah I don't know about this paper. <laughs> I took a once more with love doctor's appointment label and just filled that in. I'm going to move that in a second as well because I realized I didn't have enough room for all my stuff. So I got a pink flag from the kit. And I did a little ramen bowl that I made. I had bun for lunch, which is not ramen obviously, but it's a noodle dish, so it made do. <laughs> then I used a half kit from the half box from the kit and Target and Kmart stickers that I made. To mark that I went to Kmart and Target after uni. And I'm just going to say here that Australian Target is not the uh, Australian Kmart is not the same as American, so it's actually really good and affordable <laughs> and has cool stuff. You actually find a lot of people rave about Australian Kmart. <laughs> then I put a Kita Prince print printer sticker and because I had to print off some stuff as well after doing that and then a once more with love happy mail sticker because my scribble prints co haul came in the mail so moving on to Tuesday take a envelope from the kit uh, because I had to mail off my mum's birthday present there's some more washi it looks like I think here, yeah, I'll use an obsessed with cute, no coffee, no worky, iced coffee sticker. Just because I need coffee to exist. And I decided to cut down this full box just a little bit. Because it wasn't really necessary to take up the whole space and I wanted to make it a little bit different from Monday since they're so close to each other. Then I took this multicolor Scribble Prince Co event sticker and the Kina Prince Busy Day Kinachi appeared. And I had to write my Carmelite section. I've been working on my literature review, it's the worst. Um, I took a teardrop from the kit and a What's for a Love YouTube button to say after I finish work, I binge watched a whole lot of Plan With Me's, which was so good. Another once more love sticker, her, one of her filming stickers, which is old format, and um, yeah, I wrote in the two things that I filmed. I took a to clean checklist from the kit, as well as a laundry basket, and I got some cleaning done. So it was a pretty fulfilling day, to be honest. <laughs> I'm just going back and filling things in. Then I put a uh, obsessive cute edit button and a Kina Prince coffee cat. Coffee cats being the best. And another full box from the kit. This one I use a flag from the kit as well as a new Scribble Prince Co. multicolor laptop to mark off the work I had to do that day. So this I wasn't doing that much during the days, but it was big sections of the day, so... <laughs> but it still fills everything up, you know. So you can still do this style, even if you haven't got a lot of plans. I think it still works. Because, you know, you can put lunches and all those sort of things in. I put in a multicolor event sticker and a phone from the kit to say I needed to call my mom because it was her birthday. And I was like, you know, I should probably mark that it's her birthday, so I took a little thing and the little present box from the kit as well to mark that it's my mom's birthday and then I put the cool mom afterwards <laughs> I thought that made a bit more sense 
Now I'm just going back, filling things in. And then I had a washi strip down the bottom and I'm going to put the cleaning icon on there to see I tidied up that night on Tuesday night. Alright, back to Wednesday. I put a half box down and uh, one of my own glitter laptops that I made recently. And then a little thing down the bottom, which I can't remember what I did with it now. Oh yes, I put a little bin icon from the kit and to remind I had to put rubbish and recycling out for the next day. Then I just built up some washi. Um, to mark off a whole like sort of relax period, I needed to relax <laughs> that night. So I put a teardrop, the nail polish sticker, and the little spa face mask icon to mark my relaxing time. So that's the first half of the week done. Now I'm going to, I couldn't decide what I wanted to do. <laughs> so I put the headers on. Should obviously be my first thing to do. <laughs> and I put the weekend banner on upside down because it's just easier to line up the top of it. And I got the weekend banner and I didn't want to put anything behind it because I don't know. I wanted it to be more easy, airy and breezy. And then I put a Once More With Love coffee pot, which is my all-time favorite coffee sticker. And this is the first one I've used of it because I've been hoarding them. <laughs> I have two sheets with it on there, so I love the coffee pot. And I put a full box to mark in the work I had to do that day. So I use the little things just to sort of make little writing uh, strips. <laughs> just sort of mark off the things I had to do. And I used an icon from the kit as well as a Kina Prince You Can Do It Kinachi to mark in the last and hardest section that I had to rewrite. Ugh. Then I put a little thing down the bottom to mark my brother in law's birthday. And then I went ahead and planned some Friday. So I put a full box. A glitter laptop that I made as well as a flag from the kit and the little to-do checklist from the kit just to mark off some extra work and I don't really end up doing this work I just sort of get sort of ill and run down <laughs> after doing so much work during the week just like solid blocks out of hours and writing um, then I decided to cover up the header with a washi piece of washi and I got a multicolor coffee cup from Scribble Prince Co. And wrote I was having coffee with my uni friend Rachel. I probably should have edited this, sec this section a bit faster, but whatever. Uh, I took a half box from the kit and a Sweet Kawi Design Books to just remind myself that I had to exchange a book that my supervisor gave to me and then it got overdue so I had to go and borrow it myself. <laughs> okay, now we're going to go back to Thursday and finish her up. Took another piece of washi and um, an icon from the kit to say that I scheduled my hair appointment for uh, later. <laughs> and this is a sweet kawi design taco to say that I had some burritos for lunch because I don't have a burrito sticker. But I actually had a burrito, but I only have a taco sticker. <laughs> And I think I built up a whole section here of the wash. Yeah, I do. I sort of built up a little area. 
do some more decorative and I chose to do the same as the full box above so it sort of goes together and then I took this munchkin from the bad day set and wrote rest day because I had to rest for the rest of the day I started getting really run down and block feeling literature reviews just they're so horrible <laughs> I just it's like pulling out teeth for me then I took a half box and a little murloc sticker that I made myself just to mark down that we were going to play World of Warcraft that night. So that was Thursday. I like the way I wrote night this time. I'm still practicing on my lettering. <laughs> just going back in and feeling out that I did work and what I had for dinner. Then put some more washi in and a burger addiction sticker that I sticker that I made because we had burgers for lunch. Our uni recently got a really awesome burger store uh, put in so that's really awesome. <laughs> then I use this once more with love happy mail envelope to mark that I got my coffee monsters co haul. And then a teardrop from the kit as well as the Kinney Prince Relax sticker. Because I didn't do anything else the rest of the night. <laughs> Here we go. I decided I didn't like the way I wrote Coffee Monsters Co. So I put that leftover full box cutting and I put it over the top. And then, yes, I took a little thing, it was technically a packaged little thing, so I could have kept it as it was. But then I put my uh, Once More Love Happy Mail sticker back over the top, because it's just too cute. Plus it is an envelope, not a box, that you get it in. <laughs> then I got a half box with a Sweet Kavi Design hot dog to mark it was the federal election day. And... Um, in Australia we had just we have this thing where we have sausage sizzles at voting polls and so you have your democracy sausage as we call it <laughs> but our place didn't have any set up so no democracy sausage for me sad but so I just put down little things say I voted and a coffee monsters co iced coffee to write that I had coffee afterwards I probably should have had coffee before I voted to be honest but oh well <laughs> Then I put down a to-do header from the kit and a cut up I cut up part of the full checklist to write a mini checklist. And this was just formed by YouTube filming. So all the stuff I had to do and then a once more with love film uh, YouTube munchkin. And here I'm gonna put some washi down because my dad came over to visit and we opened the loot crates and stuff because he gets them every month and I also put a movie marquee down from the kit because we watched the ultimate edition of Batman v Superman and I highly recommend the ultimate edition it's just none of the, the stuff that they had to cut out should have been cut out <laughs> it makes the film so much better so I recommend that now we're finally on Sunday and I can't believe it I'm gonna put down I think I ended up putting down two full boxes because it was just easy to fill up the time. Another Scribble Prince Co. laptop and a Coffee Monsters Co. Highlight highlighter to mark some work that I should have done, but I, I didn't because I was really ill. <laughs> oh well. It's there. <laughs> then I put down to clean header and then the rest of that full, full checklist I cut up. Just to write down the two things I wanted to clean that day. And then I put down I think everything else I put down is from the kit for now. So if you really if you liked this kind of video and like to see more planners like those, please give this a thumbs up. Please comment letting me know what you thought because it was really fun to do but it is a lot of work. <laughs> um I really hope you guys liked watching this. Please subscribe if you want to see more. I should be doing them sort of fortnightly, which means every two weeks. 
On this last full box, I just trimmed it down a bit and then put a organized stickers from the Obsessed with Cute because, no Obsessed with Cute, once more with love, because I had stickers everywhere from filming this over the week. <laughs> so I had to reorganize everything. And but it was really fun and I hope I can do some more in the future. I have some ones uh, planned out, kits that I want to use this style. But yeah, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And I hope you have a great weekend. Thanks guys. See ya.